Hi, my name is Kavia. I'm a makeup artist and I'm going to be one of the contestants in the cook-off show. Uh, I can't wait to meet my contestants. I need to have like a variety of things they will bring up, but I'm also like so ready for them. So watch out. Pa, pa, pa. Hello guys, so this is BA here. I'm here for the cook-off show. Who is my contestant? Where are they? I can't see them. <laughs> so guys, let's watch out. Because today what I'm cooking out for you, you won't believe. I don't want to, to throw my secrets here. Just watch me, follow me. So hello guys, this is your baddest ninja here, all the way from where I come from. A professional chef. So I've been to many monasteries. I've learned cooking in different varieties, different countries. I'm here to kill somebody. So, uh, today I'm here to choose my meals. Is it my meals or my... I've forgotten the English language, but anyway, all of them. So I'll choose what I'm going to do my breakfast with. And our main... Our main what? Ingredient is... Uh, this is an ingredient or is a food ingredient? It's pineapple. Hi everyone, this is your girl Scovia. Today I will be preparing a meal that we are meant to cook, breakfast mainly. So our main dish, our main, our main dish is, ingredient is pineapple. And for this specific meal, I will be making a fruit salad using the pineapple. Then I will make a, some bread with some eggs. So let's choose. So I have this, I will, uh, I will use uh, a bit of everything. Let me put it by the side so that you guys can see. I'll use this, this. Uh, this is tomatoes, guys. This is carrots. And uh, I'll use some onions, yeah, sure, always. Uh, bell pepper, red and yellow. I just want a small one. I don't want the person to die quick. Just... So the things I will be using is, of course, the bread. With some eggs, three eggs. I will be using butter to cook the, egg, the bread. Then for my food, so I'll be using the mayonnaise. So I need garlic, but not this one. I want garlic already, already made easy for me. Okay, yeah. I don't matter to work too. And then where's the garlic? Okay, sure. Garlic work. So I'll pour all of this salt inside. <laughs> yeah, I'll pour all of this salt inside. And uh, green onions. One or two work. One or two. And yeah. yeah, my eggs and my sausage. Yeah, I think that will be it. Do I need to take my eggs and put here? No, I don't. Okay. <coughs> the red pepper, onion, then the cream, then some green leaves. and some little ginger. Ah, uh, I will be using aromat, it's the chili, then oregano leaves. Um, um, yeah, and salt, sorry to forget. So this is what I will be using to prepare my meal. Anyway, I'll just try and build something, build something. Guys, you will not be disappointed. See, with all my experience, you will not be disappointed, you know? Huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Watch out! I'm coming up. Hata! <laughs> I forgot one more thing. Before I die, there's no food without seasoning. So I go. I like the bucket. <laughs> and uh, what else? I would have loved fried plantains. <laughs> but yes, we use bread. Just for today, you know. But I don't use these things, you know. From where I come from, we don't use these things. But that is okay. Oh, uh... I think that will be okay. Hi, my name is Sheila. I'm a foodie, food blogger, cook, caterer and today I'm going to be a judge on cook-off but anyway I'll be fair I'll be 
Uh, honest. Hi everyone, my name is Lucky. I'm the production manager at uh, Karibu Shop. We do body butter and then sometimes I also venture into cooking. So today I'm going to be a judge on the cook-off. Hello guys, I am Black Coco. I am an accountant, a singer and an upcoming designer. <laughs> and I am a food lover, take note of that. So I am going to be one of the judges on this episode of Cook Off. I cannot wait to see what these guys have for us. Let's see who is the ultimate cook. So for this, as my egg will be cooking, I'll be making the fruit salad. <laughs> the pineapple is okay. Mm, I'm done. Ah, okay, I'll still have to blend that in. So walk us through your dish. Actually, what I had in mind was when seeing the ingredients, I just thought maybe doing something that is mixed, incorporated. I put a little bit of oil and show that I can be diversified. I can bring in all the ingredients and make a meal, which is colorful. Yeah, for this dish, I wanted something simple. Uh, that's why I decided to pour my eggs onto the, the bread, then have some little salads on the side. That's like the fruit salad. Simple. Something simple and edible and nice. Did you guys find any challenges while you were making? I faced challenges with time because I should have managed my time better. Like uh, just get the zap portion I needed, but I, I kind of did. You see, those are, it's a family men like us, we cook for, we cook for the multitudes. <laughs> On my side, I felt I had enough time, though I had like some pressure. So I didn't do what I really wanted to achieve, but at least I achieved something. So I hope it's great. So what's your first impression? The appearance is actually good. It looks yummy. I feel like I want to taste it already. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, me too. I'm actually very impressed um, with how this looks. And I'm quite very impressed too with um, the way he incorporated the pineapple, this is not something you see every day. Yeah, People but don't cook. Exactly. <laughs> I'm so a bit worried. I'm, about the I'm egg curious egg. to to know how this works in there. But also, I I don't know. My problem now is the pineapple was the main ingredient, yeah. so I expected to maybe see it. I expected it to be a little more visible. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. That's how I feel. I'm worried the egg might be a bit soggy because of how juicy the pineapple was. Mm -hmm. Also, the bread seems a bit plain. If we could have tossed it a bit or something, done something with it, other than just putting it yeah. on the yes, plate, it would have, the bread. It would have <laughs> balanced it out. But yeah, generally, it looks good. Yeah, mm -hmm. it looks good. Presentation. This is colorful. This is nice. Um, I think I'll give this a 7 on 10. I love everything I'm seeing here. Of course, apart from bread, I don't like bread. <laughs> and because it's a bit dry, um, I would give it a um, 8 out eight. of 10. Okay. I love the color. The bread kind of let it down a bit. I would give it a 6. Yeah, this particular plate looks yummy. So the bread is not as dry as uh, the first plate. The designs. I have issues with the designs. It looks uh, yummy. Um, I would give it um, a 7 out of 10. This plate, I feel like there's a lot going on. Yeah. <laughs>
by the I'm curious to taste this too. This salad, this is new to me. Yeah. Fruit salad, I'm not used to um, mayonnaise in fruit salad. So this, I'm curious about it. I don't know where I come from. <laughs> I've never had uh, mayonnaise in fruit salad. So this is interesting. And I, the way she started, I expected more, particularly for the appearance of this dish. Yeah, she had yeah. Of time. Uh, yeah, so I think at some point she failed with that. I, I thought this was going to come out pretty good. Uh, I'm going to give this a six. Um, I feel like she played it safe. <laughs> the key ingredient was a pineapple, so it should have been the main focus. But she focused yeah. more on the eggs and the bread more than the... The salad is like a side, just yeah, in case. Yeah, a side, not the main. And it, yeah, a lot salad. is going. <laughs> a lot is going on on the plate. She, it should a minimum like it shouldn't have too much going on, like how yeah. Doris Boris's was. So very curious though the pineapple and mayonnaise that I've never tried. So <laughs> that is really intriguing. Yeah. I give it a five. I actually really love the salad. Yeah, it is it's actually is nice. <laughs> I'm shocked, but yeah, it's actually really good. It's a very good combination. For me, at, at first the food looked so appearance-wise, it looked so nice. Yeah. And um, my taste bud, I expected a little more of chili in it, like a, a little more of chili in the food. I think it would taste better. Okay, so since the pineapple is the main thing, I would like to see how it goes with yeah, nice everything. Setting. It's actually very nice, I'm shocked. <laughs> At first we, we said that it had too much going on, but... Um, it somehow it's works for it, yeah. Good. <laughs> yeah. I the think balance. it's good, it's um, moist. Mm -hmm. It balances well, especially when you have it with well. the bread and the pineapple. The pineapple. The it's it's really nice. Good. I'll Rich. give this dish an 8 on 10. I love eating and this is what I love to eat. So I'll give it 9 out of 10. I will give it a nice 7. It's very nice. <laughs> uh, the, the egg itself it's a little bit more salty. So I can only judge according to what I was watching and I think creativity wise and everything, yeah, it would get, mm. it would get yeah, a six it's really cool. from me. Yay, I'm the winner. Of course I had to win this, like, duh, I'm a lady. Why would a guy win between this? Though at some point I would, you know, at first when I saw him, I thought like he was really a cool person, like he would really win me. By the time I started chopping the, the ingredients, he was a little bit so slow. So I knew I would beat him on that by the time. And then uh, he was good though. I was a bit, you know, I was curious to see what he would cool, like cook, cook up for me. Hello fellow men, we're fighting for gender equality. <laughs> gender equality. <laughs> Yes, yeah, so it should be gender equality this thing. I know I'm the winner interiorly. But anyway, her food was delicious. It was nice. Uh, it was nice inside the mouth. When I saw the bread, like at the last minute, he was a bit rushing here and there. Like, I think he tried to get some other things, but again, he remembered. But though, I'm glad that I won. Eventually, I'm the winner. But since it was only ladies, yes, it's because of that. I'm not even, don't, don't, don't look at me. There were only ladies judging. That is why I lost. But you guys, you know, I represented well. You saw the first thing, I represented well. To all my guys out there, this BA, I'll always represent you well. I killed her. Put in your mind, I killed her. At least was the, was the mark I had. She's just one point ahead of me, you see. It's nothing, it's nothing bad. <laughs>